Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I was thinking of some video ideas and I came up with something. Today I am, um, so I've been on the internet and I've been looking at like people doing their hair and it's all been like people with really long hair. And I'm like, my hair's not long enough to do that kind of stuff that they did. I had to make a video for people to have short slash medium sized hair for some, um, hairstyle. I'm not sure how many I'm going to do, but I definitely am going to be doing a f some. And before I get into this video, make sure to subscribe to this channel. Um, watch my lives, more of my lives. And um, also, like this video um, and comment down below video ideas or anything else, as you guys know. So we're just going to get into the video. Right. First, I'm going to go grab something really quick because it's right in my room. Get up. Okay. Alright. Let's put it on the materials. Okay. Some of them will be. Alright. So we're just going to get started. This one is. More, it's not, yeah, it is a hairstyle, I guess you hear that. This is for people that are my age and are not allowed to uh, straighten their hair. I have a straightener, but it's not plugged in. So I'm not allowed to use a straightener. My mom thinks I'll burn myself. Well, this is not turned on. So this is too cold. It's not warm at all. Now, we're just going to start with getting your hair ready. For the straightening, even though you're really not straightening it, I'm going to show you what to do to make it be able to straighten without it being turned on. Okay, so we're just going to start taking my hair out because this was uh, what I wore today. So I wore it today. I don't want that. Kind of stupid. Thank you. Now that I took it out, put my hair band up there. Jameson, can you please get the dogs? Yes, right now. I'm fo I'm calling on Ben. Okay. So, now that it is out. Now what we're going to do is we are going to brush my hair out. First, you want to brush your hair completely. And since we're doing this, I'm going to take out off my glasses. Out my glasses, off my glasses. Okay, I'm gonna brush up my hair. Next, now these are, a, this is a step you do not have to do. I'm just doing it because of my hair. Next thing I'm going to be, next, so you guys do want to use this, but this is just the kind I use. There's so many different kinds that you use. If you guys use this, this, I'll tell you what it is in a minute. If you guys use this though, like use what this product is, and you prefer a different like kind, because there's so many kinds. So this is dry dry shampoo if you guys like dry shampoo and you use that and you prefer a different kind go ahead and use that this is just the kind we me and my mom prefer because it helps our hair so it's just a spray you like it's like a hairspray but it's not you like you just put it in your hair softened up your hair because if you haven't like washed it in a day or so like if you don't wash it every day i like to use this so i don't wash it every day i wash it every other day so you say I washed it. Say I don't have to. Okay. So I sprayed it enough. Now you're going to brush it so that, because sometimes this, it gets clumpy if you don't brush after. And if you do it this, if you brush after, it gets it all through your hair and not just, um, 
not just sitting on top of her hair. Turn the mirror over there if I can see what I'm doing. Okay, so now my hair is super, super soft. Here's it. So we're gonna do it kind of like we are actually doing it. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take a lot of my hair. We're gonna just gonna go a little like that. And the rest is gonna go up and a clip. Okay. Sorry guys. Alright, so you just have a little bit of hair. You're just gonna brush that little bit of hair before you. Do the cleaning. Hi. Uh, have a doggy. Oh, yeah, I just came. There you go. Next, I'm going to take the tangular. Because, like, the dry, sh dry shampoo can make your hair feel a little bit dry. Okay, next, you're going to take. So, I just sprayed that. And you're going to leave it. You're not going to brush it through. Yeah. Now what you're going to do is you're going to take some leave-in conditioner. Leave-in conditioner. And you're going to put some in your hair and hand. And you're going to take it. You're going to rub it. Okay. And you're going to take a little part of it. And you want the part to be a little wet under. I'm looking over here, but then you're just gonna take it. Like you really straighten your hair. You're not really straightening your hair. Like you are. Do it a few times for actually like it's actually thing. Okay. See what I'm doing? See how it looks better? Straight. Straighter than it used to be. Now, you guys have short, short hair. Then a, a good way to do it, if you want to curl your hair and your hair is shorter, then you do need to use this. So I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm not going to do it because it's not on. So I'm not going to Okay, you want to just, I'm just going to, you're going to open it. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. like that. Okay. So you do it. So that's the one thing. That's how you can do it. I'm not gonna actually fully do it anymore. So don't to... right. The next thing is getting. Okay, what else should I do? Um, um, what is this? I totally forgot. Oh, it's where you're gonna take hair and braid it. I don't know how to French braid. So what I do is I like to take my hair. I start braiding it, and I braid it down this way, so that I can go like this. So that's what we're going to do. So what we're going to do is we're going to take your finger, and you're going to line it right up to wherever, how much hair you want. And then you're going to take that. Come out. And you're going to bring it forward, and you're not going to touch the rest that you just used. And then the 
rest of the hair you're just gonna put up in like a bun or the heat now it's like hot not like that there you go now you have two pieces of hair okay so what you're gonna do you take all of this hair I guess if you want, just take them, this hair right here and just clip it back for now. Just like clips. Or something. Just like clip it back. Get it back. Get it out of your way. So what you're going to do, I'm going to take some of your... Um... um um, um, leave in conditioner. You're gonna hold it back like you're about to put it up. And then you're just gonna take three sections, and this is not a fresh spray because honestly, I don't know how to fresh spray it. And if you don't know how to fresh spray it, this is probably for you. If you do know how to French braid them, yes, you can French braid them instead, but I am not French braiding. Oh my house. So you're just going to braid it in this direction so that when you let your hair down, you're able to take it back. You're just going to put it along your head. Well, not like along your head, but you want it to bring it back this way so that you're able to I'm look stupid right now. You want to bring your hair back so that when you want to do this part, you do this part. Okay. Now you're just going to take this part of your hair and you're going to get a little hair tie. And you're just going to tie it the end so that it doesn't fall apart. But you then what you're gonna do is I've put some of the cream down here. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna tap it, you're gonna take it, rub it, and you're gonna pat it. There. And then you're gonna take some dry shampoo, even though this is not hair fresh. And we'll act like hair spray. Yep. And we are. Little braid. It's going to be able to go like that. Mm -hmm. This does help strengthen it, though. The ends. And we're going to fix up the ends. So let's fix up the ends. Okay, so we. Don't use too much because it'll make your hair look gray. Okay, now you should look like this one Now we're gonna make do the same shit. Do the same
Next we're gonna do it again because we did this one. Sorry, I didn't get to any other ones, but that's all I got to. And yeah, today, in case if you guys are watching my videos, Thank you. 